Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here direct to Arcane, Season 2, Episode 2. I'm so excited to watch this, you guys. Um, I am slowly making my way through Arcane Season 2. I'm sorry, guys, it's not super often. <sighs> Life has just been hectic and busy. Um, I have this and I have Outer Banks that I'm trying to catch up on. And I'm also trying to do what we do in the Shadows Weekly. But I then I also have all of my normal weekly shows plus all of my Patreon requests, and then that's just the YouTube Patreon stuff. I still have got work every day as a teacher, which is insane, and getting crazy with the holidays also coming up, which is also insane. I do get some time off coming up very soon, and I'm so excited for it. But, like, every weekend is busy. I have plans with people. I have to... I'm stressed about, like, buying Christmas presents, and then I'm stressed about work, and I'm stressed about the channel, and I'm stressed about everything. So life has just been very stressful, and my anxiety is on another level than it usually is, and so is my depression. And it's just that time of the year where I'm just, like, starting to struggle a bit. So I'm trying not to push myself too hard. I'm trying just to do things when I... Not, like, I have to push myself a little bit to want to film. I do want to film, but I also have to don't always have the energy for it and I would much rather obviously just sit watch tv and do nothing but then also I can't allow myself just to veg out and do nothing or I feel shittier about myself because then I'm like oh well I've done nothing productive and I hate myself for it so I kind of have to do a little bit but then I'm like okay what do I want to film I really need to film certain things and then I'm like then there's things I'd rather film but they take longer and it's more energy like arcane out of banks longer episodes uh, x file suit, longer episodes, I'm just like, <sighs> sitting there for 45 minutes to an hour is just like, sometimes, oh, it's exhausting, and I just want to just, like, be done. So sometimes watching the shorter stuff, like Futurama, South Park, Bob's Burgers, that's easier. But sometimes I'm not in the mood for a big comedy like that. Uh, I don't know where I was going with this, but yeah, it's just, it's been stressful a lot, and it's been me trying to figure out what I want to do, how to do it, when to do it, all that stuff. Uh, so today I'm just trying to kind of film what I feel like filming. I'm kind of just going with my gut, and I want to watch more Arcane, so I'm going with more Arcane. And yeah, um, I know, I think part three is coming out, or already out. I don't know if the whole season's out yet, or if it's just one more part, I don't know. All I know is I'm taking one episode at a time, I'm out in episode two, and I'm excited to see what's going to happen, because episode one was crazy. We still haven't even seen Jinx yet, so I am excited to see what's been going on with her, and now that Vi's got this whole team with Caitlyn to try and get Jinx, oh, that's going to be crazy, I can't wait. <laughs> Alright, so if you're watching this on YouTube, please don't forget to like, subscribe, check out Patreon if you want to get these episodes unedited and early, along with all my other shows as well. So, uh, so check that out, link down below. Other than that, I really hope you enjoy this. So without further ado, here we go. You aren't here to put it all back together. Because you killed him. How could someone put all those holes in you? You did it. Are you like burying him in the ocean? I'd fix anything. Before I broke everything. This is kind of beautiful, but also go to say get together. Bossing me around. Now it's so quiet. You forgot no one. What is Jinx gonna do? She's gone through a lot, but I'm like, she's alone. What does that mean for her? She's never been alone. Good enough. Oh, oh. What the hell? Why are we looking at this guy? He's dead. What's going on? Oh, they're all dying. There's a few left. Oh, yeah, she's dead now, too. These three are vying for the throne now of the underworld and chaos ensuing.
What are you gonna do, Jinx? Are you gonna take control of Vulnerable World? Are you just gonna run and hide? What are you gonna do? Why are you guys going up to this little kid? This is kind of epic, though. I got Zyre. The visuals so far in this episode. Wild. Oh. Oh. Okay, I didn't die. You're gonna protect this kid, Jinx. Help him out. Or is it she? It kind of looks like it could be a girl. I'll tell. Oh! That was quick. Damn. You feel it? That. Okay, but Jinx. In your eyes? Because you know in a moment. It all boom. Okay. Playing in the world, kid. Mm. That kid was like, "What the fuck did I experience?" Don't worship her, please. Don't, please, don't follow her. Hasty. Last count, Margot had at least ten hitters guarding his stash. Margo and Cross can fuck all they want, but in the end... This guy is creepy looking. <coughs> You're dead. Oh. It's factory smog trapped underground. No more, no less. Dude, what's my mask going on? Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> You, you go on ahead. <laughs> Report back. Oh, oh, yeah. A little scared now. Okay, there we go. At least the mask on. Did these guys go in without a mask? This does not seem healthy. What the hell is this? What is that? Oh! Is it what we saw at the end of the last episode? The wolf things? I know you're all fantasizing about sawing each other's heads off. So I'm gonna get right to it. These turf wars have to oh, stop. Oh, is she gonna take a charge? Professors, I've only defended my interests. Playing coy doesn't suit you, love. You started this dance when you raided the Rapture Wall. What could I want with Varda Phil? Topside is the real enemy. Us killing each other is playing yeah. right in the You guys are really taking hands. each other out for, for them. Why is he so quiet? Oh, She's God. Right. He's you know, so creepy looking. We don't last. But I got a different solution. We give them Jinx. Oh. That's all they really want. Now they're going to go after Jinx. Don't hand over our people. We? You don't do much of anything anymore, do you, Magpie? Bird without a wing's just a funny looking rat. Damn. Think on it. But I promise, it's the last offer you're gonna get. Interesting. Everyone's going after Jinx. Your person is gone, your arm is gone. She's not doing so well. Damn. Okay, okay, chill, breathe. I can't believe you're dead, and I'm still mopping up your messes. <laughs> Jeez, lady, you crazy. Oh, oh, Stop. she's got her hair. Dead people. Well, you do the same, Jinx, so you can't judge. Favors. Oh, think that's gonna do anything? Self. So. 
you guys were both his children, and now you're lost without him. You guys gonna work together, team up? All his plans, everything we built. Does she not know that Jinx killed him? I think if she were to learn that, things might be different. Watch it all burn. She's gonna burn the whole place down, top side and down low. Is this kid still following her? Wait, who's that? Oh. What I tell you? Fuck. Ah, uh, the kid is still following though. Hi, I knew it. Oh. Oh, he's coming out of this thing. He's, he's all awake now. What's gonna what's happening? What's gonna happen to him? Oh. Oh my. Whoa. Oh. Oh. It's like metal. Kind of. What is this? What is happening to the thing he's touching? It's, it's like affecting it. Victor? My God. Yeah. What am I? No idea. You're alive. I guess that's what matters. You're alive. Oh, be careful. Old. No, I don't think so. Uh -huh. I sense a charge. A charge. A potential. What? A recursive. Unpleasant, but cold isn't its name. Interesting. What is, what do you mean? What is happening here? The hex core. Victor, yeah. it saved you. Somehow it, it adapted to your injuries, but changing and evolving. It was as if it was connected to Yeah, it's like part of him. No. Don't you see? Heimerdinger was wrong. We were wrong. It's not as bad as... It killed this guy. Yeah. She had such dreams. Oh. I still feel so bad for her. The two of them, too. They were like floaty. It could have been something. I'm going to resign from the council. I understand now. My place was always here in the lab with you. Not being oh some leader. I must say goodbye to this place now. Oh, he's leaving? To you. What? Where are you going? Victor, you're my partner. Our paths diverged long ago. Ooh. It was affection that held us together. Damn. To turn your back while your whole city looks to you for salvation? To cling to principles while your best friend bleeds out in your yeah, arms? Yeah, but you kind of made the choice. I never asked for this! You didn't have to, though. Don't blame Victor or anyone else. You made choices that you made. What's with the blindfolds? Oh, the fireflies? There's so many of them. It's all the fighting. We're gonna have capacity issues soon. Echo! We finally get rid of Silco. Just so a new one can take his place. <sighs> That's what happens when you take away a leader. There's always another one wanting the power. You can't get rid of that, sadly. Oh. Is the tree starting to get infected? Or something? Oh, this With is glimmer. quite troubling. So much. It's our food, fresh air. We built our whole identity around it. Yeah, if that tree dies, that's not good. <laughs> He's so cute. Why are you moving around like this, dude? <laughs> you're, you're under the pipes and everything. No one's looking for you there. Don't you 
don't you essentially own this place? Yeah. <laughs> Can you just walk in? Does he not want people to know he's alive or there? Where do people think he's been? What? Realize code phrase don't work when you make them up on the spot. Yeah. He's having too much fun being spy. Let him have the fun, I guess. Oh, oh, oh. Chase. Professor. Oh god. <laughs> Pupil Echo. Echo, my former pupil Jace. Awkward. <laughs> Intrusion. We were attempting to sneak in. Oh, pish posh, like you've never done it. <laughs> were you? Yeah, <laughs> I'm with you, Echo. Sometimes I like right. tea. I like like iced tea, but regular tea. Sometimes I'm like, eh. Deep in the underground, Echo's home is a marvelous place. Truly a wonder. You should see what. Yeah, let's oh. not spill all the beans. Come on. I was of course referring to his cognitive center, which is certainly not. A what do you think? What? Okay, dude, <laughs> chill. Did any of the planter? Yeah, what is Victor up to? Where is he going? What is this plan he has? Oh? What's he seeing there? And they're starting to follow him. Oh, the arcade. What you building? Oh, is she is she making an arm for her? Or is she making a weapon? Oh, that stuff is come. Oh yeah, she's being attacked right now because they followed her there. They just let her work on that thing and build a whole thing before they came and attacked. That's weird. What the hell? What is this thing? A smoke monster? Is this lost? In the... Wait. Is this Vi and the team? They're using the smoke to get around or something? She doesn't know it's her sister. Or does she? Oh, I think she does know. I don't think she can pull the big trigger. Oh. How are you still breathing and all this? I guess it's stuff she was injected with, maybe? She's making it, literally gonna survive a little longer. Don't you dare try to kill her. Distraction. Here we go. Oh. Careful, guys. Caitlin. Okay, okay, chill, breathe, breathe. Oh, oh, oh! Just need to get a little violence, I guess. Okay. She's a little on um, tightly wound right now. Oh, Jinx. 
Uh oh. Oh, damn. Uh oh, God. Oh, God. Is the little kid going to come and help? Oh, uh, ew. Don't do that again. They want you alive. But don't think I won't steer out those peepers. Draw back and you Oh, oh, oh. Me? I'm the kind of guy who likes to get in close. Ew. Please don't. I never thought I'd catch you. Silco even saw that. Twice. Oh. When he met me. And when I killed him. Ooh. Always me. Whether oh. I'm holding the pin or you're the kind of guy who likes to get in close. Uh, which uh. Oh. Who was that? Ah, uh, Bestie. But I don't think she realizes yet that Xander, Xander, not Xander, Soko was killed by her. It's going to happen eventually. It's going to be bad. But right now, Jinx needs help. Ooh. Oh. Oh, new arm. Yes, I knew it. Look at these two badass besties. Ooh. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. She's got that good speed, at least. Oh. Okay, that's it. Just a distraction. Ooh. <laughs> uh, she, this kid should not be liking this. Oh. Oh. Pull. Jackpot, hopefully. What does that mean? Oh. Oh. Ooh, that was close. Cool, though. Oh, music, too. <laughs> that would annoy me. Have music right on my arm all the time. Oh. It's... if So you can get nothing helpful? That's kind of... Weird choice. Ooh. One. Okay, what is this? Arm. It's like its own little living creature. Oh, and with the other hand. That was smooth. Okay, wait, 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 wait. There's a deal to be struck here. You forget, Smeech. You already made your last offer. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, Ninja Stars. Oh, this arm could do everything. Combos. Oh. Get the other arm. Ooh. Oh. Jackpot. Oh, what did they do? I wanted to see. Oh, that's a lot of uh, green goo. Of course, there's the fireworks. She likes to entertain. You got that look in your eye again. What are you planning? Yeah. To finish what's left of my family. Oh, you can go after Vi now? Is he about to, like, lead on me and, like, unite these people somehow? I feel like he's got some special gift. Oh, they're about to come try to kill him. Stupid choices here. Oh. 
We've got this Victor. Whatever you can do with your newly found abilities. Can he do magic? So much senseless pain. I feel like he's about to come like their messiah or something. He's about to heal them. Take it out. Take the poison from them into his own body. I don't know. It's one of the vibe I'm getting. Oh, whoa. Whoa. What the hell? Is he making him into something new, just like him? Fusing metal and gears and magic? Whoa. Oh. Whoa. He's healed, but with like some of the same stuff that was is on him. The hell? Is he about to heal? Yep, he's about to get worshipped by these people. Ooh. Victor's becoming some messiah to them. Sorcerer Supreme. Is that her? Yep. Oh, that's so sad. He's just seen her. This is about to be real interesting. Interesting. What do we? What is this now? Oh, it's the wolves that we saw in the last episode, but they're dead with the eyes taken out. What the? They're he's experimenting. Oh God! What is that? What is this man up to? Ew. What the? What is this scientist, Dr. Frankenstein thing? What is, what is he trying to create? Is he creating some juiced up creature that he plans on having as his own pet to make, make a weapon out of? And then come back and be like, look what I've got my pretties. I don't know. This was interesting. We saw like the ramifications of Silco's death, the underground collapsing, the people fighting for the underground, Jinx on the run and hiding, now teaming up with Silco's second in command. And now them kind of being kind of a crew until she figures out that Jinx killed Silco, then it's going to go real downhill. I'm excited to see, see that. Um, we saw the Vi's crew for a little bit hunting Jinx and how they're using, like, the smoke to... So I guess that's what we saw in the beginning. The smoke in that one building was them, and they had attacked and killed everyone. Which makes more sense than just, like, where to come from. I was very confused by that. Uh, so they're going around just killing people and trying to find Jinx. Interesting. Um, and Jinx is having a rough time. She has a little boy girl, I honestly could not tell, uh, following her around and wanting to be like her, it seems, which is, could be scary. It's not great. <laughs> and then, uh, what else happened? Oh, Victor. He got out, he left on his own and just is kind of wandering around healing underground people from their sicknesses, from the whatever it's called, the Shimmer stuff, and how he can heal them, and how he's this now Grand Sorcerer kind of thing, healer, messiah to these people. Very interesting. While everyone else is fighting for the underground, and everyone else is trying to destroy and fight each other, he's going around just healing and trying to fix things? While he sees his dead girlfriend? Creepy, weird, sad. Uh, we also have Heimendinger and Echo. They are... Trying to, they're just kind of living their lives in the underground with the fireflies, and but the tree in the fireflies' home is getting poisoned, and they try to figure out why. Not much about that. We haven't learned much yet, but we will. <laughs> it's good to see them though. 
good to see everyone kind of this episode, get a little more of everyone. Last episode was very focused on Vi and um, Caitlin and up there and that pe those people. This was more focused on everyone else now. I'm intrigued to see what the third episode will be because the end of part one. So very excited. All right. Thank you guys so, so much for watching with me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out Patreon, all that fun stuff, and have a fantastic day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.